I'm now joined on the Sports Mix by the head coach of the Spring Mills Cardinals, Coach Marcus Law. Coach Law, congrats on a very impressive win last week, 26-3 over Musselman. Kind of unexpected, at least in my mind, but maybe not yours. So just tell us how that game went and give us your thoughts on it. Well, when we looked at the game, we kind of got the looks in uh, the front. We kind of thought we would get, but our guys getting out there and executing um, the way we thought they could. We did our best not to force any things. I think the defense has given up, and uh, our best to execute all the defense and special teams. Your team now, with that dominating win over Musselman, improves to three and one. A team that last year was a young team. We said the young team, though, out the window. Now this team is experienced and really letting it show. Yeah, absolutely. Um, again, big contributor to the weight room for us, um, and those guys just taking the practice and, and our learning time um, very serious. Uh, and again, big shout out to our seniors that are just doing those small things on and off the field. Pitching a 26-3 win, just talk about the defensive side of things and how that really attributed to it. Uh, defense came up huge for us um, on all, um, all three downs there for us. Um, again, did a good job containing their running backs, which are very, very skilled, and their quarterback was um, pretty good in the, in the pocket there. Um, a lot of guys sliding around to the ball, uh, had a few pass breakups there, helped us out big. And then on the offensive side of things, what went well for you guys in that game? We were able to get the run game started, which uh, kind of been big for us lately here, uh, being able to get the ball inside. And then based off that, um, Max just being very careful um, and getting our way down the field there. So let's be working out. This week your team goes up against North Hagerstown Friday night. What have you seen out of the hub so far? Oh, they're, they're, even though they're young, but they're very talented. They've got some things that kind of also remind us of us from last year, just being young and guys just kind of flying around um, defensively. They'll be very similar to what we do. Um, but, again, they have some athletes that can play. What's your team need to do to get the win against North Eggerstown? I think the goal is still the same, just really offensively take what the uh, defense has given us uh, and not really try to force anything. Uh, defensively, rally to the ball, get multiple um, heads on the ball there, and then obviously do our part special teams-wise. What's kind of been the biggest surprise for your team this year? Well, not necessarily a surprise, but it's almost like it's good seeing what the results of what they've done in the weight room and actually having those guys see that it's paid off for us. Uh, but then having some other guys who haven't exactly been – vocal leaders for stepping up to the plate and doing more play with the field. After this week with North Hagerstown, you have Washington, Frankfurt, University, Martinsburg, and Hedgesville left. The team this year for you guys with playoffs on your mind after falling just short uh, last year, how attainable do you really think it is this year knowing where you guys are right now? Well, to be honest, we, we, we really try to stick with that, just playing that, that one game just at hand. Um, it's been real big for us not getting our guys to jump down the road to any particular game. But I think if we take care of business and do the things we're supposed to, uh, we'll, we'll be fine. All right. Thank you. Appreciate the time and good luck. Absolutely. Thank you, sir.